Okay, I'm out. <laughs> maybe he just really loves DK, man. Or maybe he just, yeah, maybe he just wants DK to be as good as he was before. Which, in my opinion, he does not deserve that. How can you go to, how can you nerf Greninja but you don't nerf DK? Then again, the game was approaching, it's like, it's end of the lifespan when that happened, but still. Mm -hmm. There's only a few matches where I think DK is at poor balloon. One of them is Cloud. <laughs> oh, definitely. I feel like in this game? Yeah. I think it's even. I think it's even. Like, yeah, Cloud gives DK a hard time, but DK can give Cloud a hard time. I don't know. I don't think we're going to see the DK come out. <laughs> Not versus the weak bitch, I mean. Any of the other characters, though, makes sense. I would not go DK against Weefa Trainer. In no way. Oh, is this him? Uh, CX. Ready? Oh, Palu. Alright, E going Palutena versus Soldier Pop. Soldier Pop with one of the longest losers runs of this tournament. Had to drop a game in losers so far. Three, two, he has what it one, takes. Go. Oh, is this the Z from Canada? Is this the Z from Vegas? No. It's Pikachu, doesn't he? Yeah. I don't know who he is. <laughs> Different Z. From Canada, yeah. Apito 43 confirmed Z from Canada. Okay, okay. I remember his Daycom and uh, Mewtwo from the last game. Oh, bad SD. Uh, first time I've seen so good pop SD like that too. Yeah, second time I saw it. Yeah, Z will definitely take that to the bank. You're playing a character like Palatina. Oh, big snipe. That's the deep breathing active too. Can you get a ledge trap though? Go to the. Oh no, he's still supposed to have the ledge. Oh no, now we get a hard punish on that. But damn, there's that F tilt. He still had deep breathing active, so it was insanely strong. And. Dude, it's crazy. <laughs> the more I watch it, this, the more I start to realize, like, damn, but this character becomes so strong. Z doing good job racking up all this percent. Nice. Making it very difficult for so good pop. So good pop. Man. Nice up throw and top air. I feel like so the yeah, every time deep every time he gets thrown off stage, he gets like all the time to charge deep breathing. He was in challenge. I feel like if I were you, I'd stop throwing him off stage. Just, just, just keep fighting him. The dash tag is so much knockback. Like, I almost thought I was gonna kill him. <laughs> He's in deep breathing. Alright, so he'll probably decent, uh, decently bring this back to a you know, competitive game. I know he dropped that early first stock to the SD. Nice roll there. Even though he grabbed the ledge twice, wasn't he a punch there? Oh, there's a deep breathing again. Just out of the way of the neutral air too, but even down tilt kills it that person. Yeah, I didn't even know I didn't even know raw down tilt could kill, honestly. Yeah. It's it's definitely one of those moves that like super you rarely see it, but it's really good because the angle that it sends you at is really difficult to try to recover from. It sends you at a really poor, like straight words. I would say like a like a 15 degree angle. It's a really weird. Oh, that was a really good one from the player of the soccer. I forgot that you heal when you use Sun Salutation too. <laughs> like, this character just gets super rewarded for throwing things at you. I feel like that's why. I mean, look at Tate. He's the design of the character. Oh my oh, god, god. again? God. That's the second time he's got that job to spike set up. Don't forget to exhale when it's I think it's because he's sends you. It's so good for him like, to just run off down there. 
That is a yeah, you're right. That is the second time. It's, it's crazy because like if they're too close to the ledge or they're too far away from the ledge, you just get buried by it. I yeah. guess he like always banks on them falling off for the last hit. He's like <laughs> right there with the spike. Especially at the ledge too, and that was really good from like I'm sorry, that was like Z's game. Like he was doing really well winning in there. I feel like I just blinked him and next thing I know so good pop is the one with the W. Uh, so good pop has proven to be very clutch in these like last situations where when like he's down you know, he just kinda of finds it to bring it back every time. It's nice. God damn it. <laughs> I'm so mad. Oh my god. V2B was a mistake. <laughs> what? My group chat said something about VTubers and it's hilarious and I'm really mad about it. <laughs> What's a VTuber? Have you ever... It's... You know how like Hatsune Miku is like... A virtual like... I don't know how to describe it. I've never listened to Hatsune Miku being honest here. But you know how like it's a virtual Two, pop idol? One, picture that but for like a YouTuber or a Twitch streamer. Somebody who... Somebody who's using like... A drawn character as you know. Oh, the I get it. Yeah, I get it. I but. just thought about that, that this year. I really did. With someone in my chat, who I'm probably not gonna do if I say the other day. He's a big fan of it. He just sent me something. Anyways, Z switched to D Kong. Hmm. Oh no, no, oh, no, this one's gonna go. So far he has a percent lead. But yeah, I feel like it's even harder for him to deal with uh, projectiles of the trainer with this character. Yeah, I mean, he has like a different projectiles versus Diddy is like, he does have peanut popcorn, big popcorn mod of his like startup frames and then like frames of it. So it's not that bad, it's not that great. It's pretty solid, I would say, but like, he has to be careful because, like, the fact that Silver Pop has, like, time to actually go for each one of those projectiles. And even if he doesn't hit Soccer Ball properly, like, he can just hit him with Sun Salutation. Yeah, he also gives him all the time to, um, the deep breathing, too. Yeah. And, like you said, every time Good Pop is, like, off the stage, though, he just goes for it. So, like, because he knows he has enough time, he has the recovery, the ability to stall, it's really good for him. There's technically no reason not to. Nice. I send the deep breathing with the shield to avoid getting tripped there. Oh, oh, oh man, he's going crazy off stage. He's, he's got to be careful here. Oh man, he's through him, dude. Even his throws do more knockback than deep breathing. That's nice. Talking. What happens when you give cloud limit to a different character? This is literally our sin. Our sin in cloud limit, like Loki. Oh no. Oh, I don't know what that was. See, he, I don't know what happened. Like, this is like the third time we've seen it so far on screen, but... It's not even worth questioning almost, because so good pop more than half the time has been winning the other way. Yeah. <laughs> he loses more stocks to himself. Exactly. So I feel like he's like, you know what, man? Because I'm playing a character that camps at the ledge, I'll just give you a free stock so you don't get too happy. Now if you win, now if you lose... You can't be too mad. It does give me free stocks, I guess. Yeah. You... I just, do that monkey flip getting more range in this game is like a little silly. Getting dragged from so far. Yeah. Again. Yeah, what uh so pop so good pop's doing is like every time he feels comfortable and far enough away to pull the net, he's just getting hit by a projectile all the time. Yeah. I feel like in that situation Z could have just run up hold shield, hold shield longer and then jump out of shield to try to react out of like a, a projectile, but like he kinda got stuck in that situation and probably just couldn't quite figure out something out of his time. Wow that up smash, I know it has range, but 
seeing it in action again. Definitely probably something. Well, what the? Wow, that was weird. <laughs> that was a weird girl thing. I feel like he wanted to angle it downward towards where you where so good talk was, but like he just didn't get the angle properly. And immediately eating off the stocks, dude. He's not able to get any extra credit whatsoever. Back at the ledge. The ledge game here. It's so hard to punish that. Kid. Even uh, even without like the the soccer ball and the sun salutation from the ledge, we his ledge hang it goes really low. Yeah, it does. If you actually have to be super on point to hit him. Grab the ledge twice. We fit. We fit. We fit is like one of those characters, and like because of the way that she's hanging out from the ledge, she's low enough that her her box doesn't stick out compared yeah. to characters like per se Lucario's ears or Charizard. Uh, yeah, I miss a Miz region box. It's currently NA only. Oh man, he's really good at catching the roll with that down smash. Alright, so has control of the banana though. Lost is deep breathing, so uh Ziza doesn't have to worry about dying too early here. Wait. I'm about to get it right now with him being off stage. Nice command grab again, he just keep he's keep catching uh so so good pop and shield. So he's grabbing for free every time. Yeah, oh, what a what a job. Oh, oh just mash it dude, it doesn't matter man. Especially him being at the ledge. Yeah. Yeah. I respect it too because Z wanted to jump out of that situation and then maybe come back with like another jump or a side special or barrels. But like the fact that like Wii Fit's moves just came out fast enough pretty much was what killed Z there. Yeah, it's like, hey, yeah, whenever he is deep breathing, he just like rushes them down because he knows if, it, if he hits them with anything at that person, he's on. It's basically almost on command Arsene. The only difference is that you don't have hitboxes like Arsene. Oh, <laughs> uh, we saw Z's Joker and DK. We're gonna see the Joker. No, we saw. We, we haven't seen. Yeah, we haven't seen. Well, the I mean, I'm just saying the characters he's played in the tournament. So. Downside of deep breathing, like, does she get like, lighter or anything like that? To what I've noticed, no. Well, I, I, I haven't seen too much of, like, we fit to tell anybody, like, indefinitely, like, oh yeah, there's no downside. I think the character actually has increased weight. <laughs> <laughs> if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> I'm not lying, like, it's an all around buff. <laughs> And with how easy it is for her to get it, it's like very, very strong, I guess. Yeah, the recovery is like not too bad. She gets heavier and faster. <laughs> there's like almost no downside. That's why, that's why Cesar told me, like, bro, you need to be careful with this character. This character is broken and nobody knows. Basically, imagine, oh, imagine if you had to fight a zoner with a really good recovery. And that, <laughs> uh, like fighting a zoner that like suddenly becomes like, Three, and with super two, speed, one, <laughs> a zoner with monotonous and less and <laughs> All right, I guess we're not playing on this stage though. Yeah, he's going fox. Like the fifth character he's played now in tournament. Okay, so the one thing I can actually confirm to you though is Mission the one thing complete. about Weefit is when Weefit grabs the ledge, Weefit does a pull up motion, so you can actually punish Weefit for that in that motion. But otherwise, from the night before, Weefit is doing the pull up. You can you can't punish Weefit from hanging on the ledge because we, her her box doesn't stick out. It's really hard to look for that specific animation though. Yeah, you, you I don't think they're going to be hanging on the ledge long enough for that to be a thing. 
No, no. But if they do hang out long enough, like you will, you will see them, and you can get the hurt box, which is really funny. Mm. How do you feel about Fox in this matchup? I don't Is like it. He's like, you know, tournament life on the line here. I'm not. I think it's even. Fox is able to burst you so fast and so quick, do quick damage, close the gap, reflect their attack, good lasers for, for distancing, but also being off stage, like with almost any character that Fox has to fight, specifically, I think, music, it can be difficult. Way, way difficult. So I feel like it's a pretty even matchup. But I'm, I'm not Larry. I'm not Light. I'm not Korean. I'm just telling you how I personally feel. Looking at like, both characters on paper. Yeah, I can see that. I can see why Z would like to go Fox in this matchup. It was looking more. Like, more. like I said, reflector on deck, good burst damage. Uh, right. Knockback from some of the moves, like he can do pretty, pretty well. But one thing I just feel that Fox has trouble is honestly just kill him. Yeah, I was, like if you don't get like a setup into his up smash, it's pretty easy to just hold shield versus a lot of his like so called you know, yeah. But nice, caught him jumping in his face. Mm -hmm. And also, Fine. like about Fox is like you have to keep in mind what percent thresholds will you stop losing those confirms because at a certain percent that will no longer confirm and you're forced to find a kill in a different manner like a raw kill basically or a call out this Fox pig doing wonders here like yeah. the the uh, range but oh, those guys went crazy with these comments. oh, oh damn Oh, the range that Sogo probably wants to play at to throw these projectiles, Fox just doesn't care. He just runs in there. He has the, the reflector as well. Speed, the reflector, the damage, the attack, laser, like I said, to also, like, if you want to camp, fine, I can just laser you. Like, at least once or twice, if I, you know, whenever I do it. By the way, this is going, I'm kind of surprised, like, he waited till in three to pull up Fox. Same. <laughs> Same, but I also respect it too. Like, like I mentioned, like Fox can get the one thing that makes Fox like a, somewhat of a more of a glass cannon in this game than the previous games is his recovery is pretty poor. So it's predictable. Uh, I think his recovery hasn't actually changed. I think it's actually better in this game because he can uh, go freaking change the distance of his illusion. Oh, that is That's true. Is uh, being lighter in this game is what really. Makes his recovery getting hit like even worse. I don't know why they did make, decided to make Fox one of the lightest characters in the game. But... <laughs> Mash that fast enough. Uh, before, if he was able to catch the mashing out with like the sweet spot of smash, but uh, it doesn't seem to work at full up after sneak. Yeah. Oh, he does get the stock on save five percent pretty good. Oh my god, he took 44 from that. Oh man, okay, this reflector is doing way too much. Oh, he's got 63% just from projectiles. So he, yeah, he's still 60% from projectiles, bro. Like, that was really good. Like I said, it's burst damage. Like, he, he knows, like, I can just play the zone. And even then, Fox's options at the ledge aren't as good as they were in Smash 4, but they're still good at the ledge. You know, so Wii Fit being at the ledge just kind of hurts Wii Fit just enough. Yeah. I'm gonna sleep on Wii Fit, though. Yeah, don't. Uh. Like, Still scary. very very strong. Just See scary. now. Oh, oh yes. the up smash! We already saw that roll coming. Oh, if he had gotten that forward smash, that would have been death. That could have been death, honestly. I don't think it would have been death in the but it could have been. I'm sorry. Just trying to get some time to charge up the projectiles here. We got the ledge again, but there's the back here catching the ledge jump. I'm telling you. It, it Fox's ledge, obviously, granted, not as good as Smash 4, still good. And that killed Wii Fit. This backer also got nerfed too, I think. Yeah. There's knockback goes. <laughs> that is nerfed for Fox, that everybody comes with like, up tilt. Up tilt doesn't two frame at the ledge as good as it used to, it's pretty bad. Um, his, his combo percents, it's like, have to be frame tight, and... There's just a lot of things. I I just feel like Fox just needs more like 
I wouldn't necessarily say am I on moves, but I would just say give him like fine-tune a couple things. I think he just needs a couple fixes. I wouldn't be able to tell you where because I'm not a Fox main, but I do see the problems. I don't think Fox deserves any changes whatsoever. I think he should be the way he is. I would prefer he doesn't change. <laughs> I was impressed by this character. <laughs> uh, good stuff to Z. Finally getting a game. Like, I think it's the only game that Soda Pops dropped so far. Yeah, it is. So good Pop. I don't know why I could call him Soda Pop. But, uh, he's, this is the first time he dropped a game of Losers. Damn. Fox Pig working out. Reflector and like the ability to just get in on uh, We Fit much easier seems to be pretty mild that. Yeah. It's it's done a lot of mileage, but also like the fact that like you know Z can close the gap. It's a, it's a combination of Reflector being at the ledge, Fox's speed, his adaptation against so good pop for the past few games. Like it, it's put him here in game four. Um, definitely for Z to kind of close it out the next game. I would definitely have to say stick to the same game plan and then but also be aware of like so good pop also making adjustments because we did see him like try to call out illusion and he was really close to it and also like be very weary of like being off stage but i think z is gonna go wolf and this is actually a a matchup i don't know what to say i think it's almost the same as fox maybe even slightly better for wolf because fox more only because he has he's a little bit faster on the ground yeah, can we'll- get in on the weaker bear, but Wolf still has a reflector to deal with the projectiles. So. But consistent kill options too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. True. Oh my god, he just shot the eye away. Nah, forget it. Good posture begins with a strong face. Wolf has Wolf isn't as fast as Fox, but he still got really good speed. I just have to deal with the uh, the stage, honestly. Maybe he just likes the stage more with Wolf than Fox. I wouldn't have not gone to. I think I would have stayed Fox. I think this is really good stage for for Wii Fit personally. The way I'm like seeing it. Any large stage is good for Wii Fit. But specifically this one, I feel too, because you have the platforms on the side, which Wii Fit can jump to as another option to land. Yeah, like Scarab is already really hard to ledge trap, but now they can have a platform above them too. Yeah, and you have to really call out that platform. Like, we saw that from Zeus. We tried to call him out from the, the back at the platform, but like, so good, so good pop is nowhere going to be near it. This game is much closer than last game. Really good call out though, with up smash. Back throw. Yeah. Oh, no, nice throw instead. I thought he was going to go for back throw this way off but fourth throw so good. So, though, still killing even without the deep breathing at that percent. So, wait, did he have rage? I can't tell. <laughs> like, <laughs> when they have rage, their body is all like different colors. Yeah, so we think flashes when when she has um, deep breathing, but when you have rage, your body like, um, consistently emits steam, as you can see on the now. Oh, it's really good for Slugger Pop. Already at 56% on this stock here. Like, he doesn't really have to force anything now in this situation. Ball and Z to, you know, get his kind of. Yeah. Because we could trainer with like projectiles, it, it's kind of rough. Oh, really good on the reflector. Uh, he can reflect that, but like, he's so far away that he has no time to shield it anyway. Oh man, this wolf pick, I, I don't know. This is, this is not looking like the move. <laughs> All these hits right now. Good shine to avoid getting sniped off stage, but man, you can't get back to center. Yeah. 161 oh, fire. Did the sniper hit him while you got. Yeah, yeah. Alright, we'll take it. 164, but there's the deep breathing up to yet again. Being able to like dash faster, this lets him do like that super like full screen run at you with like the added boost to his like sliding uh, up tilt. Doesn't hit that more often. Now, the little pop, and, like he's one stock away from moving on the losers' finals. As he can make some, you know, adjustments here. Yeah. Like I said, I would have preferred this to have been Fox matchup. 
I don't think this is a bad fox age either. I actually like Tronpick Mystery quite a bit just because of the, the walls on the side. Yeah. Oh, close to the cigar though on the forward smash after a bit of down air. So we're gonna, uh, so we're gonna pop this thing a really good job of just like being really cautiously aware of Z and like where he's at. Like every time he hit me, he's always good dunk for dunk, doesn't it? But like he goes for projectiles at the ledge for a really good reason, but he's always around like, okay, you know what, he's gonna go for a reflector here, I gotta watch out. Even if I use him to the out, but it's still good for me because he's still hot and it stops his momentum. We're gonna pop is all over this guy, man. Z is like, he doesn't know where to shield, where to go. He doesn't know what this weakness is doing right now. I see, this is kind of one thing I wish you saw from Z a little bit more earlier. Blaster was really good to our fuck a lot of the projectiles. <laughs> Except maybe so especially the ball, which is really which is so good pops like MVP. So if he go for blaster a little bit more, like we, we might be seeing a slightly different game, but Oh, he's out of here though. Why now with an SD you hate to see it, but that's where you can come sometimes. What's up, Z? Yeah. 